Hey, welcome back, everybody. I was uh, I was beginning to wonder if y'all are going to show up because I've been waiting here for a while. No, I'm kidding. Um, in this video, I'm going to create part number 31. We're, we're, we're getting to the end of these parts, and I am bound to determine that I'm going to complete these, at least get the parts made today. So, yeah, on to the next one. So, I'm going to go to New, New English Standard Create. I'm going to start a 2D sketch on the XY. I'm going to, what am I going to do? I'm going to, I'm just going to use some lines here. I'm not going to get too fancy. I'm going to start it off on this origin. Wait, let me do that again. I missed it by that much. <laughs> I'm going to start it off on the origin. Yeah, there we go. Drag it over to the right. This is going to be one. I'm gonna go up by 0.5. And I'm just gonna draw it over a little bit to the left and then angle it down. So I'm gonna ang I'm gonna I'm gonna angle it down. I'm gonna dimension this angle, and that's gonna be 60 degrees, like so. There we go. And I'm gonna finish my sketch. I'm gonna extrude this symmetrically. I don't know why I just like doing it symmetrically in case I ever need to come back and find the, use the midpoint of the plane or whatever. You know what I'm talking about. Oh, symmetric. And then this is going to be three and one eighth for the distance. Three and one eighth. I'm going to slap that OK button like it owes me snacks. And then let's see. Uh, oh yeah, I need to put on the back side, there's going to be a hole. So I'm going to add a hole. That hole is going to be 3 8 diameter. And it's going to be simple, none, flat drill point at the bottom. It's not going to go all the way through. So this distance here is going to be 1 16th which it already is, 1 16th, isn't it? I want to add it again just because I want to be cool, 1 16th. So I'm going to just place my hole somewhere in the middle. And then I want to dimension it from the top. That's going to be 0.25. And then from the end over here, that's going to be 1.5, like so. Does that even look right? <laughs> That's the dimension. That is the dimensions I wrote down. So I'm going to go with that. So I'm going to say OK. And I'm going to add some fillets. Some fillets. This is fillets going to be 1 8th, or I'm sorry, 1 16th. 1 16th and it's going to be this top edge and this bottom edge. I'm going to hit apply and okay, yeah, yeah, all right. Looks good. All right, so now we can add our material on here. I'm going to go with mahogany. Should use maple, maple syrup. Anyway, I'm not gonna use it. I'm gonna keep what I've been doing. So dark medium gloss, and I'm going to fix my texture. Double click that one. Sample size one, one. I'm gonna leave it just like it is right there. And hit the X, hit the apply, exit, exit. X it. I'm gonna go file save. This is part number 31. Part 31. Hit save. All right. So there's that one. I think that's the dashboard. Um, in the next video, I'm gonna try to make maybe three or four all together because they're you know they won't take very long. So we're we're finishing up 
the parts. So make sure to come on back. All right, peace.